Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Alan and welcome back to the channel. I have on this little marshmallow suit here because we're fixing to go underneath the house and jack up the floor. Let me give you guys a little bit better look at what we're about to do. So you guys won't be able to tell this on camera, but there's a spot in the floor right here where there's just a little bit of a dip. So it kind of from the door here is pretty level. And then right here at this seam, it dips down just a little bit and then kind of levels off. So we're gonna go underneath the house and try to jack this up, try to get this floor nice and level before we put any flooring on it. And let me show you where we're gonna go underneath the house. So here's our access point where we have to crawl underneath there. Derek and I put a whole bunch of stuff in a sled that we're gonna take under there. We have to go kind of down through this hole, out that way, and then around that way to get over. And kind of where we're gonna be is underneath uh, that area over there. Well, let's do it. All right, I think we're about to wrap it up for today, but we got this leveled off quite a bit, so it's a little bit better than it was before. And then also we worked outside for a while. I didn't film a whole lot because underneath the house it was obviously nasty and very uh, dark down there, and there's only about a maybe a foot and a half or two feet or so of room to maneuver around in there, so I didn't want to take my camera down there and get it all gross. But whenever we started today, there was a big pile of metal and trusses and just kind of scrap lumber laying here. So we got all that moved out of the front yard. So now the front yard is pretty well cleaned up. Just gotta do something with that tarp over there. But you can see we got the yard cleaned up. It's starting to look a lot less like a uh, tornado damaged house and more like a almost ready to move in house. Since this episode is really short, I think I'm actually gonna go ahead and save this footage and put it in with the next episode just to make it a little bit longer. So I'll see you guys in just a second. Today we're back at my in-laws house working and we're doing something really exciting. We are actually going to start painting today. So we're fixing to kind of prep everything, tape stuff off, tape stuff off, <laughs> and uh, we're, gonna, we're actually using a paint sprayer. So we're gonna try to use a sprayer to paint all this. So I'll try to film what I can. Obviously I don't wanna get paint on my camera so I'm gonna have to be kind of careful, but hope you guys enjoy the video and let's get going.
this is what the walls look like with one coat of primer. We haven't done the ceiling yet. Um, the ceiling is just going to get like white ceiling paint. And then the walls are going to be kind of like a grayish, bluish color. And uh, we got most of the house done as far as the walls for this, with this first coat of primer. We ran out of paint about halfway through that wall, so got to get some more paint. And then we will finish that up. But even with just one coat of primer on there, I feel like it's looking pretty good. And as far as the way we were painting this, um, Derek was using a sprayer, and then I was just going with the roller, just kind of back rolling just to get rid of any drips. So hopefully it'll end up looking pretty good in the end. We just finished up our first coat of primer back here in the bedrooms, just on the walls only. Haven't done anything with the ceiling yet. Whoa, it's kind of dark, sorry. And we also did this hallway and we put one coat of primer in the bathroom. So covered up some of that green board. And this wall is going to have uh, something different on it, either like some type of paneling or something um, that'll just go there and then can be unscrewed, you know, if you have to mess with the uh, faucet there on the shower. That way you don't have to tear up the sheetrock anytime you want to, like, replace a shower handle or faucet, whatever. Paint it all around in here. And then we also painted this bedroom. And this went really fast with a sprayer and then me just kind of back rolling it. We did all the walls in this entire house in one day with one coat, which I think with rollers, I don't think we would have gotten all that done in one day. And we also did this hallway right in here. It's a little kind of closet with a little drywall shelf up there. Stand back so you guys can see that. Then this is going to be the home office. And we just kind of taped around these shelf brackets. We didn't paint this area right here. You see this kind of yellow, just because we patched a couple spots there. So we're gonna wait for that to dry before we uh, put any paint over that. So this is all painted. And the utility room also has a nice coat of primer on it. I think that's going to go ahead and wrap it up for this episode. So all the footage from this video is from a couple different weekends, just all kind of compiled into one video. Uh, I know I've got paint all over my <laughs> face and hair from rolling around that sprayer. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, we're really coming along well on this house. Uh, the next thing we got to still paint the ceiling with, uh, it doesn't have to have primer. It's just going to be a, a white ceiling paint, which it says you don't have to use primer with. So we'll be doing that probably next time we're here. And then the color that's going to be on the walls, let me show you that real fast. So this spot right here that's just kind of a you know, slight shade of blue, that's going to be the color that we'll use on the walls all the way around the house. And uh, that's going to be like basically in this great room. It's going to be all that kind of bluish white color. And then back there in that hallway and those bedrooms back there, that's going to be a little bit brighter color. It's going to be what's called Oxford. Uh, it's like a, basically a shade of white. Well, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed this episode. And if you did enjoy the video, be sure to hit the like button. You can also subscribe. We're getting really close to 50 <laughs> subscribers. <laughs> so hopefully we can hit 50 by the end of the year. Got a few weeks left. Maybe we can do that. <laughs> All right. Anyway, we'll see you guys in the next one.